So this morning I'm picking up where I left off yesterday and that is editing the video that is late that I'm going to try and finish and get out in the next hour and a half. And then today's just like a grind sort of editing day. Um, I'm editing the video where I used the Wacom Intuos Pro Paper Edition. I actually drew that on the Wacom Intuos Pro Paper Edition. I feel like I need to say the whole name of the thing every time I use it. The last time I used a uh, pad style tablet was when I borrowed my friend's old bamboo tablet and um, it felt nothing like this. Like this, I, I, I've never even for any reasonable period of time used a, an Intuos Pro, let alone a, a really new one. I think I used uh, an Intuos Pro years back, but one of the older versions and it still felt good, but this like, it's so thin and like nice. So <laughs> um, it's good. Technology's come a long way, you lucky children. I feel like that came across as an insult. I was speaking specifically to young people who don't know the age of cassette tapes, VHSs, so on and so forth. Youths. After I finish that, I'm hoping I have a little bit of time left over. Uh, to edit more stuff because I have three virtual reality videos unedited. I started editing one, but I really would love, love to edit all five videos today. Don't know how likely that is, but uh, with the help of my trusty shortcut keypad, I'm hoping that if I throw myself into it with a lot of elbow grease and determination, I can get at least most of the way there. Do you know what really helps in these situations? Checklist. I'm rendering the new outro for the uh, draw with a mouse challenge and because I did classical painting recreations I thought this one would be fitting. I really like that aside from just customizing him I can change the color and saturation of the frames and the backgrounds gonna be different every time I feel like it's gonna be a really cool new fun thing every time rather than just a different character Okay, so I've spent the last several hours editing the uh, Intuos Pro Paper Edition video and guess what? It's time to finish. In fact, I've been working sort of late at 6pm and I have to go. And this is how far I got on my checklist. Yay! I'm nearly done the Intuos Pro video, which means I'll finish that tomorrow morning. Fortunately, the other three were optional, but I actually did do sort of like the first half of that first video. So, you know, look, not all is lost. Uh, but tomorrow I'm going to be recording a VR video after I finish up the Intuos Pro Paper Edition video. So that'll be fun. I can't wait to show you that. Question of the day comes from Malha Bagi, who says, how do you choose the question of the day? Sometimes it has to do with if it matches the theme of the video. Sometimes it has to do with if it's something I feel like talking about or have particular feelings on. And sometimes it's due to how much time I have left to answer the question of the day. And today I don't have much time. So I picked that one. The end. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. And the moral of the story today is sometimes if you reach for the stars, you only catch the moon. But it's still worth reaching for the stars. But I mostly pretty much catch the moon. The moral of the story is I'm overambitious. But one day I'll catch those stars.